Hello beautiful people. This is me iOS Pro Hacker. This video is sponsored by Cool Master iOS Assistant. And in this video, I am going to show you that how to transfer iPhones, iPads, iPods data into your computer. I am going to show you that how you can transfer your data from iPhone to computer. You can easily transfer contacts, text messages, notes, calendars, bookmarks, music, videos, photos, books, applications and everything in the iPhone to your Windows or Mac PC. It works with all iPhone, iPad, iPod models. That is the software we're gonna use. It is Cool Master iOS Assistant. It is the full iOS data manager software for our computer. There's also an Android version of this software to transfer the Android data on your computer. You will find the direct download link of this software in the description of this video. So with the help of Cool Master, you can back up your iPhone, iPad, iPod data to the computer without losing the data on the iPhone. It can also use to import the data from computer to iPhone. And one more interesting feature is there in this software which can help us managing the iTunes backup data. Yes, if you have created an iTunes backup and you want to see or transfer the data from that iTunes backup. Suppose uh, you have iTunes backup and you just want to export some photos from that backup file to the computer. So this software will also help you with that. You can manage your iTunes backup data. So let's go and download it. It is available in Windows and Mac both. Right now, I am running Windows, so I'm gonna go ahead and tap on the Windows Download button. After downloading it, just go ahead and install it in your PC. Once you install it, now you have to connect your iPhone, iPad, iPod to the computer to start transferring the data. Make sure you have an original Apple Lightning cable and unlock your iPhone, tap on trust button if it is showing. You can see my iOS device has connected. Here it is showing up my device information. And if you see on the left, here we have different applications from where you can transfer the data. As you can see, it is showing up about 753 contacts which is in my iPhone. So it is very simple to transfer it in your PC if you want. All you need is to select any specific contact that you like to transfer or you can select all the contacts once if you want to transfer them all. So to transfer them all into your PC, you have to tap on this export button. And now it will ask you that in which format you want to transfer the contacts, CSV or VCard file. And then just select the save location. Uh, you can see on the desktop that now the contacts have transferred. You can see this file. This contains all of my iPhone contacts. So you can save these files in your computer. If you want to transfer it into any other iPhone, send it to the email and open it up in the iPhone via email. You can also create new contact edit any existing contact or import any contacts file, delete the contacts at once directly from here. Anyways, next you can see, I can also manage my text messages as well. Here it is showing up all of my messages which is on my iPhone right now. Uh, you can read any conversation or export it to the computer. Simply select any conversation and tap on export button. I'm gonna export it as the text file and save it on the desktop. So as you can see guys, here it is the new folder created on my desktop containing the text file and here we have the conversation in the text file. So this is how you can simply export your messages to your computer. And here we have some more options. Uh, you can transfer calendars, uh, your saved Safari bookmarks as well. And next we have the songs option, uh, like if you have downloaded the music from iTunes store uh, into your iPhone. So you can transfer those downloaded or imported music files from your iOS device to the computer. To transfer it, it's simple method. Just select the files you wanna export and tap on the export button. 
you can see on my desktop the files have imported uh, let's delete them because <laughs> i don't need them and next if you have voice memos uh, in your iphone you can transfer it to your pc but right now i do not have it in my ios device so it is not showing up here and this tunes option to export the custom rig tunes if you have created any of them and let's go into the videos and we have movies option if you have downloaded or imported uh, the movies in your iphone so from here you can export them to your computer uh, to export it just select them and tap on export button to transfer it it's very simple You can see on my desktop and uh, we have the TV shows and music videos options uh, but uh, right now I do not have any of them in my iPhone and here we have the photos option to transfer the photos from your iPhone to computer. Uh, you can see it is showing up all the photos here uh, which is on my iOS device so to transfer it to the computer just select them and tap on the export button. Choose the save location. And you can see the files have transferred. So this is very easy. Uh, next we have the albums option. If you have created any custom albums in your iPhone, so you can transfer those to the computer directly from here. We also have the books option to transfer the books from iPhone to computer and computer to iPhone. If you have downloaded some books in your iOS device and you want to copy them to your computer, so you can do it. Uh, it's simple. Uh, you can also import any kind of PDF files to the iPhone. Uh, here we have uh, the applications options where you will see all of your applications which has installed on your iPhone. So you can delete them from here by selecting them in bulk. Uh, that's useful uh, when you want to delete a lot of applications at once. Alright, so this was the tutorial for transferring the data from iOS devices to the computer. So thank you so much for watching. See you later in the next video. Peace.